I'm gonna go ahead and keep it a buck and say that Avatar The Last Airbender's live action series that we're gonna be getting on Netflix is doomed to fail. It is gonna be a complete and utter failure and hopefully I ate my words, but I'm telling you it's gonna fail because the creators of Avatar The Last Airbender have completely jumped ship and now it looks like they have talked with Nickelodeon and they've opened up Avatar Studios, which is going to be an entire production wing of Nickelodeon that just focuses specifically on Avatar The Last Airbender through movies, TV shows, expanding the lore for that series, and I am here for it. So the live action series, I will talk about it when it comes out after I watch it, because I will watch it. I mean, I watched the original, so it can't be as bad as M. Night Shyamalan's Avatar, but I don't have much faith in it because even the creators don't want to be a part of it. They jumped and made their own animated series or movies. They're working on a whole universe for Avatar and Avatar is such a downplayed series and such a downplayed world where people think all you have is Avatar Last Airbender and Korra but there are so many different possibilities threads in this extremely rich world that can be expanded upon as much as say Dragon Ball, Star Wars, Marvel, DC, Jurassic Park slash World Series, like they have more shit out than Avatar does and yet Avatar has in my opinion one of the richest worlds in all of fiction and even in season 2 of Korra which was probably my least favorite season of that series, they had an entire few episodes, I think 4 or 5 episodes, maybe 3, probably lower than that, where they talked about previous Avatar content like at the very beginning the dawn of Avatar in that world and how the benders came to be and how the Avatar came to be and it was so interesting that that was my favorite part in all of Legend of Korra that was my favorite little mini story inside a very bad season because it was plagued by Nickelodeon sabotaging Korra which they absolutely did they sabotaged Korra and wanted it to flounder and die moving its time slots eventually only having season 4 for online which is so crazy to think about and now they're realizing that there's much there there's a huge fan base for avatar that loves avatar and wants it back and can't wait to see what happens next that now they've given the aok -okay for an entire studio to come out with new stories and new movies i cannot wait to see avatar ang um when he's an adult before korra i want to see a whole series on their adventures as adults i don't care if it's a prequel to korra i really don't care i want to see that i would like to see after korra um when Korra ends up with Asami, I want to see what that future looks like, what the next Avatar is going to be, who the next Avatar is going to be. Are we going to be getting like, like World War One era type of stuff where we have like machine guns and poison gas? Like, is that what the Avatar world's going to be? And at the same time, there are other things like stories that the comic books and mangas, I guess English mangas tell where they talk about the story of Zuko's mother and how they went to search for her. So there are a lot of different threads that can be tied up and can be given attention with Avatar The Last Airbender so I can't wait to see what they come up with and again I, I, I'm gonna be saying it now before the live action series comes out I don't have much faith in it I think it's going to fail but I do think that this is a shining beacon this is definitely like the more positive outcome to the live action series if the live action series sucking and the bad choices for that series influence the creators original creators of avatar last airbender to search out and and lobby for their own studio to make their own uh, stories animated then you know what then the avatar then shitty series uh making better series i'm here for it anyway thank you guys so much for watching let me know in the comments below did you guys start out with avatar the last airbender or legend of korra or have you never seen avatar before let me know in the comments below, guys. This is going to be Sunscape. Signing off. Take care, guys.